Hi guys, in this video uh, we will see how to configure routing on firewall. So let me first uh, quickly set up the firewall and uh, switch configuration. I will show the configuration one by one but uh, to save the time let me configure the firewall. I mean the initial configuration I will do. Ok, so now firewall is up and I am able to access the console so uh, the, uh, the target of our today video is that uh, uh, we will configure interface 2 here as a LAN in Sophos firewall and we are going to configure uh, uh, VLAN here means layer 3 uh, will be configured here layer 3 in the sense that uh, we will be configuring uh, interface VLAN and I will be assigning the IP address as well on that interface VLAN and we will be pointing a default route to the firewall and firewall from the firewall also we need to point the route to the switch so that uh, the communication will be full so let's let's see let's let's go to the firewall so I'm in the firewall I have just configured the interface uh, uh, C where in GNS it is uh, interface 2 ok ok port C ok let's go to the switch and uh, configure the interface here as well configure and I'll create a management VLAN here suppose I am having VLAN and interface VLAN 10 IP address 192.168.1.2 there I on the firewall I have configured 1.1 .1. here I will configure 1.2 no shut and interface so IP interface do so IP interface brief so uh, interface 0 to this one I need to put it in a VLAN 10 so exit interface E 0 slash 2 switch port mode access switch port access VLAN 10 okay let me set up the route p default gateway and 2.168.1.1 okay now i will be able to ping to the firewall should be pinging it's reachable from the switch let me go to the okay so my target is to put this uh, this uh, network this devices in a different VLAN and this devices in a different VLAN ok so let me configure the VLAN here config interface suppose let me create VLAN 20 interface VLAN interface VLAN 20 IP address suppose I am giving 10.10.10.1255255255.0 ok no set ok now VLAN 30 to put this VLAN 30 interface VLAN 30 and uh, IP address 10.10.20.1 ok ok the IP is configured let me put the interfaces in uh, uh, respective VLANs so here I have interface 0 slash 0 in uh, that VLAN 20 VLAN I will put 
interface e0/0 switch port mod access switch port access vlan 20 and interface and interface uh, 0 slash 1 switch port mod access switch port access VLAN 30 ok so if I check uh, ping from VLAN 20 and VLAN 30 to the firewall I will not be able to ping let me have a cross check first let me check the IP address so IP interface brief ok so ok let me make the VLAN interface VLAN 30 no shit it is in administrative mode so I wanted to make it uh, no shit ok ping to 192.168.1.1 from ok it is pinging from management VLAN because if I assign uh, because directly that is connected directly ok so it will be pinging you don't, don't need to give a source also because this interface is directly connected to the uh, firewall which is in VLAN 10 only so let me uh, give ping from source VLAN 20 I will not be able to ping I am very sure ok see I am sending the traffic ok but uh, firewall doesn't return the traffic if you want to check with the wire sock capture start capture ok ok so let me again ping see I am just sending the request ICMP request but I don't see the any return traffic ok so that's the that's the uh, thing if I ping from the uh, VLAN 30 also will be the same thing see I am sending the traffic from 20.1 but it is not recognizing because uh, it firewall is receiving the traffic but there is no return traffic so what in this case what we need to do is we need to tell to the firewall that if you want to go to the 10.10.10.1 uh, .10 .10 I mean this network 10.10.10.0 slash 24 network then you have to go to the fi uh, switch ok so let's go to the firewall uh, firewall here ok and go to the routing and in static route you have to add in IPv4 unicast route so let's uh, 10 dot this is destination network ok so 0 slash 24 you can select from here gateway is 192.168. the switch IP address ok the switch IP address interface C we have to select the interface proper interface ok ok so let's test it now um, let me go to the G uh, GNS and YSR also I'll open and here ok let me ping from inter VLAN interface 30 I will not receive any traffic ok but as soon as I as soon as I ping from interface VLAN interface 20 I will get the ping see I have just added the reverse route in the firewall but 
if I say I have not added to the VLAN interface uh, 30 so I will not get the rep reply here you can see here I am sending the request again I am I am receiving the request also reply also request and reply both are there so let let me go to the firewall and add again one more route for this one let me add the destination uh, network as a uh, 10.10.10.20 for VLAN 30 and let me add the switch IP and interface now I will be able to ping see I am able to receive the traffic and send the traffic so similarly I, I don't think that uh, uh, I mean I don't need to configure anything in this this thing because I have already verified that um, it should it, it will work okay so that's that is how you can configure the route in here in firewall so this was the route configuration so you can configure any kind of route you want the static route only you can configure in the firewall in this section